What's up guys, the CB Bros coming at you. Today, uh, me and Lincoln are gonna be showing you guys some of our airsoft guns. Let's get into it. And by the way, make sure to check back in on the channel tomorrow because me, Lincoln, and my dad and my brother are gonna be doing some airsoft battle royale. Let's get into the video. Now we'll show you our guns. All the guns and uh, equipment that we use to have fun airsoft battles. Uh, you got the ammo, the thing for the shotgun to load the bullets, the fully automatic Tommy gun, um, the um, single shot assault rifle game face renegade, um, the fully automatic pistol, um, the ghost mayhem um, sniper pistol, uh, the game face recon pistol, and uh, the game face voodoo shotgun. So now we'll be showing you guys um, shooting them. Okay guys, so here I am with the Recon Game Face Pistol, and I'm going to be shooting at a target. This uh, gun is not electric, it's just a single um, cock, and yeah, safety and fires right there, a little switch, and right now it's on fire, so we're going to be shooting at the target, and the mag goes right into the bottom. It holds a maximum of 15 bullets, and here we go, we're shooting the target. It went a little bit over. This gun can be a little um, crazy with its shooting. It might go up, down, left, right. You don't really know, but for the most part, it is usually accurate. So, on to the next gun. Guys, so here I am with my brother's pistol, the Ghost Mayhem. It's like a sniper pistol, but we never got to put the scope on because it didn't really work. And if you do get it to work, um, the scope is a red dot scope, which is pretty nice. And um, it's a pretty longer um, pistol. And um, it's the same kind of thing as the um, recon. It's like um, from the bottom, you got the safety and fire. It's a little different from the other gun. Uh, right now it's on fire. The cock's kind of hard because you have to put your hand on this thing right here and then pull back. This one's a little easier to cock than the recon. And um, I think um, it's a really good pistol. It's very accurate and um, we're gonna be shooting at the target. So um, stay tuned for all the other guns that we have that, that you saw, and we're gonna be shooting them all at the same target, and let's get into the uh, mayhem. Right, so as you just saw the ghost mayhem, now let's get on to some other better guns than the ghost mayhem. Let's hey guys, so here I am with my favorite gun, the Elite Renegade Game Face Assault Rifle. So this gun's amazing because it's because the stock is exactly like the shotgun. It can extend, it can expand and then come back in. And then you have he, right here, this is for like a sling if you want to put that on. You see the orange um, thing for the uh, to make sure it's an airsoft gun. You got the two scopes. Um, it really looks like a real AR. On this side, you can see this button right here. That's how you take out the um, magazine so you can fire. Right here, you, it's on safety right now, so there's safe, fire, and then another fire for extra um, extra FPS, and you cock it right here, which is pretty cool. And it looks like a real gun, and it's really accurate, so let's shoot it at the target. There we go, bullseye, guys. I love this gun, it's so accurate. We'll put all the links in the description to all these amazing guns. So let's get on. Those were my three guns. Now we're gonna do Lincoln's three guns. Technical difficulties right now. And uh, this is the Airsoft Eating Machine. He's ate about a thousand of our bullets. His name's Moose. Uh, he loves biodegradable bullets. And yeah, now let's get on to Lincoln's guns. Hello guys, I'm Colby's friend Lincoln and this is my fully automatic pistol. Um, it is a uh, Heckler & Koch P30. Uh, it's only a six caliber gun, but right here, the only way to fire it, there's no safety on this gun. So if you pull the trigger, nothing's gonna happen. If you push this down and then pull the trigger, it will shoot. It's not the most accurate gun in the world, but I still love it because you can put it on fully automatic right there or semi-automatic. Um, I'd like to keep it on full. Now right here, all you have to do is just squeeze this 
and pull the mag out. The mag can hold up to 16 bullets and it came with two of them. Right here is the battery compartment. It is uh, electric, is an electric pistol. Right here, there are four AAA batteries. You just gotta close that and yeah, let's get on to shooting the gun. That's all for his gun. This gun cannot really reach that far, but and it's not too accurate, but if you see somebody running across at really close range, all you gotta do is just squeeze this and hold down the trigger and... Guys, this is my other gun. This is the Game Face Voodoo Shotgun. Um, it is probably my second favorite gun behind the other gun over there, the fully automatic Tommy gun. This right here is the clip. Um, it can hold up to 18 bullets. There are two buttons on either side. You push those in and then you pull it out. Some of the bullets come loose every now and then. But all you have to do is just grab these two right here. You put the bullets in here and then you put this part, the bottom part, right into this. And then you grab the stick with the bullets and then you just push the stick through and it'll push all the bullets into the magazine. Um, and then you just put this in right here. Once you hear it click, that's how you know it's in correctly. Mike Colby said it's exactly like his uh, AR. All you have to do is just push this button in and it'll extend and then push back to normal. Um, the way to put this on safety right here, it is on fire right now. It says push for safety on. Push that in, now it's on safety. Push it back, now it's on fire. All you have to do to cock this is probably like any pump action shotgun. Push it back till it clicks, push it forward till it clicks. Now we're going to be showing it shooting the target. Okay, I definitely missed that time. I'm pretty sure it went right around the tree. I'm not sure if you can see this. This gun's actually really strong. I think it's a max of 390 FPS. You can cock it up to three times. It'll shoot up to three bullets. And the gun slowly gets weaker and weaker when you uh, cock it more than once. So yeah, let's get on to the last and final gun. Hello guys, this is my last and final gun, but it's also my favorite gun, is the Game Face GF SMG. Um, it is a fully automatic Tommy gun. It's battery powered. Right here is where the battery is. And the battery is right in there. It is a reusable battery, so all you have to do is just plug it into a standard um, charging port and it will charge for eight hours. Eight hours is the minimum, and if you charge it for the maximum of 12 hours, you can get up to 12 hours of play. Um, right here, this you can put a sling on it, but the sling is actually on my shotgun over there. This is a hop-up magazine. All you have to do to load it is just twist this until it makes a clicking noise, and you know it is absolutely full. Once it stops shooting bullets, just twist this. It can hold up to 800 bullets. And right here, it's on fire. To twist it to safety, all you have to do is just wrap this around. So I'm going to put it back on fire. Right here is fully auto and single. Uh, you twist it to single and twist it back to fully auto. Whichever spot the red dot is facing means it, it is on that mode. To take this out, all you have to do is grab this, push this down, and the magazine will come out. I don't really want to take it out uh, right now. Um, this gun is really long. It's really hard to aim in accurately, but... This gun shoots um, super straight. It is really strong, and it's about $87 on Amazon. I would definitely recommend buying it. The way to put bullets in is just push this bot back and just load the bullets in. Um, so, yeah, let's show sh it shooting at the target. Right now, it's on fully auto, guys. So, yeah, I think almost all of them hit the target. Um... Just to show how accurate this thing is, sometimes the bullets will curve. Um, it is also easily scratched, as you can see around this. It, some of the paint has scratched off, but it is, it is an amazing gun. If you plan on getting this, the gun will last a very long time. Um, and yeah, those are all of our airsoft guns. I think we have a few more things to show you, like our bullets, uh, our masks, and a couple of things that we use to help us load our guns. And guys, we recommend you need uh, to get a quick loader for this gun because if you try to put in like your um, bullets right there, uh, you're gonna spill more than you get in. And um, 
you don't really want to waste the bullets because if you waste them all then you're probably not going to have enough for a second load unless you get like 500 bullets like me and uh, Lincoln did so um, we will put all the descriptions to all the equipment we used and in the description below and links to it on Amazon so thank you guys um, for watching the Tommy gun and let's show you guys the rest of our equipment by the way guys uh, you can actually put it on more or less power uh, the more you put it over here the faster it'll shoot if you push it this way uh, the less power it'll have and like Colby said we are going to put every single link in the description of all the equipment we use in the yeah, let's head on over to everything else hey guys so now we're going to be showing you the rest of the equipment besides our guns so uh, me and Lincoln both have biodegradable bullets. I recommend these because they are premium um, biodegradable bullets, as you can see on the side. They, um, they degrade very fast. Um, they are very good bullets. If, if you, you, I recommend you get the color white so you can see them coming and you don't get um, shot 20 times against uh, fully electric guns. And here we go onto the mask. So right now we're using Nerf Rival Mask because they work exactly like uh, Lincoln's real airsoft mask. Um, as you can see, you have the mask so you can still breathe with the little holes. Uh, you have the uh, face mask and the glass. Uh, you have padding and then the strap. As you can see, they're a little scratched up because uh, me and my family play like 24 seven. And um, stay tuned for some videos tomorrow where you're gonna be doing quite a bit of airsoft videos tomorrow. So uh, make sure to check back in on the channel tomorrow. Uh, here's my mask, as you can see, it says Minton on the side, like our channel name. Um, I hydro dip mine, if you don't know what that is, uh, make sure to go look it up. You dip it in spray paint and water, and it makes it turn a different color. So mine was exactly like this one, except I hydro dipped it, and now you can see the difference. This is my trademark mask, so if you know who, who you get shot by, it's me. And then bullets again these are very good bullets now i'm gonna let lincoln show you his equipment and let's get into his equipment hello everyone it is lincoln again colby's friend and i'll be showing you some of my equipment i have another mask at home but this one's definitely much better it is so comfortable so easy to put on i would definitely definitely recommend getting this uh the link for this will be in the description on amazon so right here is how you tighten it and loosen it you got to pull it uh towards the mask to tighten it and pull it away from the mask to loosen it. I like it really tight because this mask is actually very big. Now if it is a sunny day, right here is a visor and this is actually like sunglasses. You can't see through it, but you can see out it very clear, clearly. It's super easy to breathe, breathe in this. And if you do get shot, it doesn't hurt at all. You won't feel it at all. You might not even know that you got shot. Right here is for ear protection because actually my friend Colby got shot in the ear and it really hurt. Right here is to hear more, um, so you can hear your friends calling out. And I will be showing you the sling that you saw, saw on the shotgun. Right here is a shotgun. And this sling right here, you can put it on any gun that has these on the end of it, like we saw on the Tommy gun and Colby's AR. I would definitely recommend getting this if you are carrying more than one gun. It is super good, and sometimes when I'm using the Tommy gun and I'm using the shotgun, I will put the shotgun around my back and if the Tommy gun were to say run out of ammo, which it probably won't because how much it carries, um, I would just pull this out and most likely destroy them with it. So right here is the quick load that we were talking about uh, for the Tommy gun. And we actually recommend it for Colby's AR because it's the same problem. You'll, if you try to pour them in, you will get more bullets out than you will in. So right here, you got to put the bullets inside of here and it can hold up to 90 bullets and then you got to close it. And all you have to do is just push this and the bullets will come out, let go, more bullets will flow in. Push it out, it's super reliable. Bullets will never come out of this. Um, and if you don't want this in, all you have to do is press it in and then push this button and it'll stay there. The way to get it unstuck is just press this and it'll come unstuck. Now right here are the bullets that I use. Uh, they are biodegradable. I know that they don't say it on this because we put it in a different canister. We will put the link to the actual bullets on here and we may or may not flash it up on screen. Um, but they are the same size. There are 5,000 bullets in here and they still are like 20 grams. And they are amazing bullets. I would definitely recommend getting these. Um, and yeah we will be showing the sling on every gun we'll probably flash a picture up of them on the ar and the tommy gun hope you all have an amazing day
and see ya. Okay guys, so now I'm going to show you my quick loader. So my quick loader is a 500 count um, premium ammo gram. So you can just unscrew the top here. So the blue top will come on loose. And then if you just flick um, this little straw up and then you can just shake the bullets into your gun of like the sh um, Tommy gun and the, and the AR. So now we will be showing you all of the um, guns with the sling on them that can hold it. All right, guys, you've already saw the sling on the shotgun, so we will be showing it on the Tommy gun. It works exactly the same. All you have to do is just unclip this and hook it to one of these and just put it around your body. And if, per se, I have the shotgun with me, all I have to do is put this around, grab the shotgun over here, and I can carry two guns at once. And if you have a pistol that fit in your pocket, you can even carry up to three. I love the sling, it is super reliable. Um, if you have a gun like this where they are a little bit too big, all you have to do is probably just switch them around because some of them will work better than others. And I will be showing it on Colby's AR. So here is my AR with the sling. Um, the sling works really good on the Tommy gun, um, the AR, and the shotgun. Um, so the bigger side, so the thicker side of the um, attachment to attach the sling to, uh, you might want to put this clip on it, and then for the smaller side, you want to put this clip on it. Uh, so it, it will go on. So it's kind of like Lincoln said, uh, you can put this around, and this, and this gun holds um, around 400 bullets at max capacity, and then so you can grab another gun and then take it with you. So say in a battle royale, I had my shot or my AR with a sling, and then if it was out of ammo, I could get the shotgun and then still be fine. And then uh, this gun, the AR, is really cool to load because you just do this. So as you saw in the AR, you push this button, the mag comes out, and then you just shake bullets out. So right now, there is no bullets in it. So um, yeah, that's my gun with the magazine. <laughs> and yeah. Bah! Thanks for watching this video. Please make sure to like and subscribe and turn on the post notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos that we'll be doing tomorrow. Um, thank you for all that you watch, and um, thank you for sharing this with your friends. And see ya.